Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to easily damage opponents with wasps in a single match. Now, this challenge sounds impossible. It sounds horrible to do, but what you're going to want to do is drop on down to Team Rumble. I hate recommending Team Rumble for challenges since I think it's so much better to do it in the normal game modes, but for this one, it's basically impossible to do in the normal game mode. Let's just be honest here. So drop on into Team Rumble, and then what you're going to need to do is save up a ton of gold so that you can start rotating through your augments until you get the wild wasps augment so what i'm gonna go ahead and do is start re-rolling these now i only have 200 gold so i'm not sure if i'll actually be able to show it off in this video yeah we didn't get it right here so unfortunately i didn't get it but if you're like me and you need gold then what you're going to want to do is run around to these capture flag points then go ahead and stand at the capture flag until you claim it and believe it or not that actually gives 200 gold so it's a very good and quick way of being able to get gold in this game just a little bit of a sidebar there. Going back to the main task at hand though, for this challenge you're going to need to get the wild wasps augment. Now what that augment does is it means that every time you get a kill and when you first pick up the augment, you're going to get a wild wasp jar. Now the reason that you're going to need that is because you're going to need a ton of wild wasp jars in order to complete this challenge because each wild wasp jar is only going to get you about 30 damage because that's how much damage they do on impact. So what you're going to need to do is then get enough of the wild wasp jars that you're actually able to throw them just over and over no matter how many times you miss what's really good about team rumble is that you can always kill another opponent and get back your wild wasp jar because with the wild wasp augment that means that every time you eliminate an opponent you get another wild wasp jar and since you're in team rumble there are tons of people always respawning so if you run out of wild wasp jars all you need to do is kill an enemy player to get your wild wasp jar back and then go ahead and deal damage to the opponents. Now, of course, there are wild wasps roaming the map like I found right over here. And for these, all you're going to need to do is go ahead and gather them. Of course, they can be really annoying sometimes. But as you can see here, each one of them will actually give two wild wasp jars, which is really good. Wild wasp jar. I can't say it for some reason today. But then what you're going to need to do is just go ahead and find some enemies that feel like they're bots and throw them at them in order to easily complete this challenge. So this guy right here is going to be a little bit annoying because he glitched glided away but now he's right below me so all I need to do is go ahead and throw it and I missed so see this is why this challenge is so much easier to do in team rumble because if you did this in a normal game mode then every time you missed you would need to go ahead and get more and look I even killed that guy with it so if I had the wild wasp augment that means that I would get the wild wasp jar back and be able to do it again to another player so overall that's how to easily damage opponents with wasps in a single match this is a hundred damage you're gonna have to do this in team rumble because in the base game mode it's just not gonna fly so overall that's how to easily complete this challenge if you guys did enjoy this video or find it helpful then please consider leaving a like and subscribe to the channel as that would help me out a ton i hope you guys all have an amazing day and i will see you guys in the next one